Good afternoon, everybody. New Hampshire Hobby Logger, and it is the middle of August, 2023. And some of you guys might start to recognize this. It's the old engine for the gasifier to charge the battery banks of the old chip machine. So we got a new new kid in town now, and uh, we've tried to get this in operation before. We had a little problem with the blower. Uh, so we got that got that all fixed up, and it's the day before tomato harvest. So this is the only time I have to play with this thing. And this is the uh, DXF4 from uh, Thrive Energy, Thrive Off Grid, Matt Ryder's uh, build. So it's a charcoal gasifier. Uh, it's got a little water tank right in the front here. That uh, that's a water drip that goes into this nozzle, and it's supposed to help the production, I guess, help make fuel. And I've got some of my charcoal on the top that I made last year that I keep uh, in storage, and then I've got some of the uh, charcoal that's made uh, with Matt's uh, charcoal kiln in there too. So it's probably enough to get started anyhow. And in uh, the filter box, I have just some sawdust. It's a uh, rough stuff that I use uh, down at the processor. So I'm going to try this out. I, like I say, we did try it before, and I had forgot originally, because this guy here is my Arduino control with all the gadgetry and whatnot, and the uh, O2 sensor that went with that, and I had forgot to close this port off, which would be this hose right here, which comes from that that feed from the gas fire to the engine, and guess what? I couldn't get this thing to run at all. So I got me a nice little cap to put on the end of that, so that'll close that off. So all the gas now comes through the hose and the filter and from the gas fire. So we are going to give this thing a uh, maiden run and see how it's going to do this time. So we'll close the lid, put the camera on the stand. It's, from what I've seen so far, it doesn't take long to get this fired. I always have the wrong glasses on, but that's all right. All right, that'll probably give us a, an idea. We'll plug it in, plug in the blower, get that started, start the, uh, that's a little better, open up the ignition port, which I found that if you put uh, never sees on there, it'll open up a little better the next time, get my torch, Forgot where I've been. I think everybody has a problem. Where'd that torch go? Okay, let's uh, turn this sweetheart on. I got all these clothes for the time being. That's closed, that's closed, that's open so we can get the blower going. That sounds better.
gun. That's pretty impressive. So I'm going to turn on the, I'm going to energize the uh, alternator. That's usually a pretty good draw on these things. That's a 13 horse 420 cc engine from Harbor Freight. It's a Predator. And I've got a lot of time on that thing from the wood gas, from the chips. So um, everything's looking good. I'm surprised this thing really put it oops, fires right up pretty quick. All right, let's go see if we can put it, put the hammer down on it.
be able to see some red in there. day of getting ready for the, the big takedown. So I know it works. Um, it's been uh, raining for the last, uh, last summer of this year. Uh, yeah, it rained three times this year. All of June, all of July, and so far, most all of August. We had a couple of good days, but uh, yeah, this has been a real trip trying to get anything to really dry this year, but my god, it's working. This is working. This is a big sucker. This is, uh, oh, got to be close to 40 inches. Big charcoal gasifier. Check it out. Bye bye.